Hello everybody, this is a very special episode of Blind Man and the Beaner, which is created by uh, Brian Starner of Toy Nuts, which he's not here at the moment, but... We thrive on Motu, Matches, and Maginex. Pretty much, yeah. Three M's. And, and that's, that's the voice of the boy wonder himself to my Batman, Overlord. Say hi. Great Scott T, you blow a lot of money if you want to. Oh jeez, anyways, uh, yeah, that goes without saying... But anyways, um, yeah, I got to thank the awesome bro of ours, Dizmania, for, uh, for helping me uh, figure out the codes. Which the codes are embossed in this area, if you could see. It's kind of hard to see, but that's number 70, I think. Well, you got, you got to feel, feel the sack. But yeah, they're, they're embossed right there. Anyways, right there, you can see it. But, uh. But yeah, it's kind of hard to see, but you kind of see it in the light. But anyways, like let's get. Punch, but it doesn't go all the way through. Yeah, what he said. But yeah, let's let's check out these dang figures because I've been wanting to get these guys. So let's check them out. See what I got. Ah, oh, here we go. You're cutting out, man. But uh. He waited all week. He used his precious hard-earned money. And I got the Cyclops, which is cool. I got the awesome Cyclops. He is so cool. I'm so glad I have this dude. Here's his armor. This guy is rad. I'm in love. This guy's awesome. This guy is sweet. This is cool. More so than the Boglins? Well, the Boglins have got mad love too, but yeah, this is this is cool. Cyclops is freaking cool. This guy is awesome. This he is was a, in my top ten... Today. This is a cool figure. He'd probably be in my top ten too. And you know what's funny? If you look at his pantaloons or his underwear, they're yeah, very it's, like it's very Motu esque. I'm glad I pointed that out. Me being one of the top Motu fans in the world. Yeah, count <laughs> well count's not here. <laughs> He's at work. But anyways, um, Props to count, but anyways, um, another brother. But yeah, here's the fly guy, which I'm very stoked to have because he reminds me of Baxter Stocksman's, and this guy is awesome. I'm so glad I got this guy. I'm so glad I got all my. I'm, I'm so glad I got all my buddies like Overlord into collecting Imaginex. Uh, oh, somebody's calling us on Hangouts. Somebody needs to answer it. They're they're interrupting this very professional. Uh, <laughs> recording <laughs> but yeah I got the fly guy what does the fly guy come with what is this oh uh, yeah that's his exterminator pack yeah it's exterminator, exterminator pack this thing is you sweet it his back and then you put the yeah the yellow uh, hose thing that's hanging there. yeah I got it I, I got it or his human hand no this is rad this thing is cool so cool all right, so we got the fly guy, we got the cyclops, and what was the, oh dang it, what was the and next the one? We got everybody here. All right, and last but not, we got Sean Henry joining us, hobby man. He's here also. Sean Henry, the hobby man. Oh yeah, and the last, I didn't want to get him, but I did get him, and I got the werewolf now. He's all like, he's got the what happened hands too. What happened? But he's not bad. He's all right. I think I like the wolf, the werewolf or Wolfman, better now than when I first saw him. When everybody else got him first, but um, maybe I was just jealous. I don't know. But um, this is awesome. This werewolf is cool. I don't really care much for his little monocles or what? What do you call them? The not monocles, but the shackles, manacles. Yeah, I don't know if I care for these. Cause they remind me, they're not like the, I guess the whatchamacallits, what's his face, um, uh, Killer Croc or K Croc or Kmart Croc or whatever his name is, but, uh. Yeah, the Killer Croc ones are different, I thought they were really different. Yeah. Uh, he looks lame with the shackles, he looks like he's just like, he's not stoked, he's like, I'm shackled. So not cool. Yeah, I took them off mine. So, so not cool. 
But yeah, there's my pickup. So I'm almost close to having like this whole wave kind of done. And then they can be joined by the sister. The Warrior Queen is one of my favorites. I don't think it's all my bro's favorites, but she's my favorite. She's awesome. And then the um I guess he's he's a Chinese warrior, right? This guy or is he Japanese? I can't remember. But he's cool. I guess he's like the shout out to uh somebody said um like uh, Big Trouble in Little China. <laughs> 